Hi everybody, I am your Prasad. As I promised you in my previous video, I am shooting now this topic. Direct and indirect address. Direct and indirect address. This is a subtopic from instruction codes. Computer instruction, instruction formats. This is a topic from third chapter in the first unit. Third chapter is basic computer organization and design. Basic computer organization, how computer is organized and how it is designed, how it is manufactured. Right? Here instruction codes nothing but computer instructions. The basic group, collection of group of instruction which, which indicates, which performs, which tells to perform how computer speed should be. If, if it is i7 processor, in that group, group of bits, micro operations, micro code, micro program will decide the i7 processor speed. Right? The collection of group of bits will indicate the computer to perform its speed is called instruction code definition. Now direct and indirect address. Before that, in my previous video also I told you CPU. CPU means central processing unit, processor, brain of the computer. In that we have AL, automatic logic unit, cache memory and we have control unit also, control unit. And in control unit we have control memory. In the control memory we have control words and control variables. In control variables we have group of bits that indicates the speed of the computer, instruction code. Nothing but micro program, micro instruction, micro operation and micro code will decide computer speed. So there we have registers, memory, RAM and ROM that will comes in this topic, direct and indirect address. So come this side. So the question will be asked in previous years or this one, explain about direct and indirect address. Explain about direct, the name itself contain, very simple, easy. Here, we have instruction format, A, A diagram, instruction format, or our instruction code or computer instruction, anything, same. Computer instruction, inside computer, processor, register, we have some instructions, rules, commands, instruction code, instruction code formats, methods, those are this one. This is part A diagram, this part. It has three fields, three boxes. See, first one is address 0 to 11 bits, means 12 address, 12 bit address. Then op code, op code means operation code, which operation it should perform, whether it is the arithmetic logic unit should perform addition or subtraction, multiplication, division will decide by this three bits, 12 to 14. I will show you here clearly. I, I is a instruction, instruction mode. This is instruction mode. I stands for instruction mode, one bit flip flop. Flip flop is a one bit cell, either it can store zero or one. If it is zero, I already told you in my previous video, if it is zero, direct address. Zero look like D, no? Remember like that, direct address, one. Indicate starts with I, indirect address. Keep a mnemonic like that. So here, the explanation for that. 0 to 11, 12 bits for address. Address, in which address the operands are stored. Operators. Next, 3 bits for operation, code. 12 to 14, after 11, 12 to 14, 12, 13, 14. 12, 13, 14 bits are operation code. Which operation it should perform? 1 bit for mode field, in section mode instruction format. 0 for direct, remember like this, 0 for direct, 1 for indirect, I, 1 for indirect mode, indirect address, right. So this is basic thing. Now coming to our topic, direct and indirect address. This diagram indicates direct address and that diagram indicates indirect address. Very simple, the first part, this whole diagram is memory part, either it may be RAM or register. RAM memory. In RAM memory, here we have 0. 0 indicates 0 for direct address. So, 22 is the address of this reference. 22 in the form of binary actually. In motherboard, in registers, in flip flops, we have zeros and 1s only. Inside registers and inside memory. 0 is 22. We are showing 22 here. But binary equivalent, binary value only we have to take. So, first 0 bit indicates direct address. Here add is taken. Instead of op code, Operation code, addition operation in this example. 457 is the number for address field. That address number is this. That in the form of binary inside. Actually, we are showing like this. In the textbook, he has shown like that. Here, you can put any, any number. 
no need to buy hat while writing exam you can write your own number right so that 457 reference this pointer direct address will shows the upper end the value the value and that indicates this is a part of this is a piece of uh, a memory part so he has shown like this so many parts will be there inside the ram this is one of the piece and that will add adding and adder the value will be in the ac ac i already told you in my previous video accumulator register accumulator register. that is direct address address will be direct if i explain that you will understand the comparison right here for example take 2 plus 3 equal to 5 2 3 these are called upper ends upper ends 2 3 this plus is called operator here you can put plus or subtraction also multiplication also any operation in this example I have taken in this scenario operator as addition and the operation result will be in the accumulator so now this is the C that A diagram is for instruction format instruction format instruction method how instruction will be stored in three fields three boxes instruction code same computer instruction same that is the basic for knowing this here we have indirect address B part B is direct address part B this part C is indirect address here in indirect address 35 is the address reference for that one one means indirect address one means indirect address indirect address this is a memory part add same operation is doing here add this 300 is in the equivalent of binary value this is address value that 300 pointer is showing here here upper end is not there one more address field is there right any number you can put 1350 right that is the second reference first reference is 300 here we have one more address that is called indirect address one extra field is there that's all in between this and that second reference 1350 upper end upper end means value 2 3 value is here actual value so that that will be added that stored in the accumulator accumulator register that is called indirect address. very simple this is direct address where is your nose this is direct address where is your nose if you if you round here is our, here is our nose so it, this is indirect address something like that very simple in direct address here the value direct operand is there here first pointer one more reference is there in that second reference that same reference we find operand in the second place that is indirect address that, that's all